Hello, welcome to an introduction to the basics of web design and development. My name is Peres Rathod. And today's agenda is, first, we will learn, what is web design, second, we will learn, what is the process of web design, the steps or life cycle of web design, third, we will see, which technology can be useful in web designing. Finally, we will conduct web design workshop. We will be happy to help your team. Let's learn, what is web? Dictionary defines, web is a complex system of interconnected elements. In our context, web means, interconnected electronic documents, we called it web pages. Then, what is website? Let's learn that now. A website is a related collection of World Wide Web www, files that includes a beginning file called a home page. A company or an individual tells you how to get to their website by giving you the address of their home page. From the home page, you can get to all the other pages on their site. For example, the website for IBM has the home page address of www.ibm.com. Tim Berners-Lee invented the World Wide Web in 1989. He founded and directs the World Wide Consortium. Now, it's good time to learn, what is web design? Web design is the planning and creation of websites. This includes many elements. Web design includes information architecture, user interface, site structure, navigation, layout, colors, fonts, and imagery. All of these are combined with the principles of design to create a website that meets the goals of the owner and designer. This is what we will start in workshop today. Design is a key part of web design. This includes both the design principles, balance, contrast, emphasis, rhythm, and unity, and the design elements, lines, shapes, texture, color, and direction. Let's understand, website design and development process. Some key points to remember in website design and development process. 1. You need a good project plan. 2. Larger projects need a project manager. 3. Adopt a development framework. 4. The project life cycle encompasses the entire project from start to finish. Web design and development life cycle is most important process. It includes following key steps, 1, custom requirements and specification, 2, information design and taxonomy creation, 3, graphic design and page template creation, 4, construction and content development, 5, quality assurance and user testing, 6, publishing and promotion, 7, ongoing maintenance. Generally, professional web developers always follow these steps for successful web project. Various tools and technologies are used during the process of designing and developing a website. Let's briefly check some of them. Behind every beautiful website there are complex jargon of technologies and architecture working. We can explore, starting from definition of network to complex architecture. 
Computer network is two or more computers connected together for the purpose of communicating and sharing resources. Two or more computer networks connected together for the purpose of communicating and sharing resources, network of network is called Internet. Internet infrastructure is a high capacity communication link that carries data gathered from smaller links that interconnect with it. Client server can describe a relationship between two computer programs, the client and the server. For internet client is web browser and server is web server. Client requests some type of service, such as a file or database access, from the server. and server fulfills the request and transmits the results to the client over a network. Web client is connected to the internet. Usually runs web browser, client, software, such as Internet Explorer or Firefox. Uses HTTP, hypertext transfer protocol. Web server, continually connected to the Internet. Runs web server software, such as Apache or Internet Information Server. Uses HTTP, Hypertext Transfer Protocol. HTTP is a set of rules for exchanging files such as text, graphic images, sound, video, and other multimedia files on the web. Web browsers send HTTP requests and server replies. Domain name locates an organization or other entity on the Internet. For example, we already mentioned www.ibm.com. Domain name system divides the Internet into logical groups and understandable names. Associates unique computer IP addresses with the text-based domain names in browsers. Uniform Resource Identifier URI, identifies a resource on the Internet. While, Uniform Resource Locator a type of URI which represents the network location of a resource. Now, it's good time to learn about web development technology. Client and server side web development uses markup, programming, scripting languages and databases along with other technologies. We will quickly see few of them. Let's see common client side technology, HTML, hypertext markup language, the set of markup symbols or codes placed in a file intended for display on a web browser. HTML is a markup language designed to structure information for presentation as web pages. HTML5 is current version and it has changed the game of web world. Cascading Style Sheet CSS, control how web pages are displayed in the browser, and allow the separation of presentation from structure and content. JavaScript is a lightweight scripting technology which is used alongside HTML documents to make websites more interactive. PHP is a fast, server-side scripting language that is used to create interactive, dynamic websites. It is particularly well suited to integrating with a range of databases. XML is a software and hardware independent markup language designed for describing and transmitting information. 
it is set to become the most common tool for all data manipulation. Perl is a programming language that can handle input and output from a web server, usually through the common gateway interface CGI. It is most commonly used for form information. MySQL is a fast, open source relational database management system that uses the popular SQL, structured query language. It is perfect for most websites that need database. Now, we have high level understanding of foundation of web design and development. It's very good time to conduct team learning activities and workshop of designing home page. Usability experts, including Jacob Nielsen and Kyle Susi, have often emphasized home page design for website success and asserted that the home page is the most important page. Home page design is one of the most important aspects of any website design and development. That's why we have selected as an object in our workshop. Let's get started now.